angry voices at a special called school board meeting before classes ever started. Parents reacting to a mask mandate in Baldwin County schools. I know why I did this. It was no hidden agenda. It wasn't politicized. When classes began earlier this week, every child in the second grade and above, every teacher and staff member, required to wear a mask in school buildings and on buses. It wasn't an easy decision, according to Superintendent Eddie Tyler. It was to protect employees and students, you know, and that's what I'm doing. Since the mandate, there have been voices for and against, and now those voices will be heard at a public forum. Let them come, say what they need to say in a manner that's proper and respectful, and we'll hear both sides. Afterwards, the board could overrule Tyler and remove the mask mandate or put a stamp of approval on his decision. I know what I want to do, but right now, come Thursday night next week, it's in the hands of the board. The board either, either supports what I'm doing or the board talks and decides that this is, they want to go another route. We're going to take the mask off, and I'm fine with that. Tyler says while he's trying to keep the virus at bay, he is also battling to keep schools open, using every tool he can, including the mask mandate. On the Baldwin County Beat, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.